Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 2 of Bochy the Rocks. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. And a puppy. She about just like an ice bath? I couldn't do it. Do you belong, baby? <laughs> you just gotta go and find out. Bochi, then you'll never go in. Honey! <laughs> Pacing. I mean, yeah, because she looks cute doing it. Oh, she's staring. Uh, okay, well, we get this time, you know, to know each other, you know, do introductions. Talk about school, oh god. Hmm. Jesus. I mean, hey, that's not, there's nothing wrong with that, though. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, my God! <laughs> oh. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> ah. <laughs> oh my god, baby. <laughs> yeah, please explain. Oh, poor baby. So she would hate any type of summer song. She would feel so depressed. Okay, are any one of you good singers? Maybe, yes. <laughs> Bochi! Okay. Yeah, can you sing? Well, never mind. Roll? Well, maybe the girl with the redhead. It's a perfect idea. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Nichika, you're changing the <laughs> conversation! <laughs> Did they really just compare? Yeah, they did. <laughs> oh. Uh. Because she is a loner. Nope, don't even ask Bochi. <laughs> you know, they should kind of count maybe live, like streaming ones, but then they also have to pay for that. But yeah. Oh, baby. Oh, my God. <laughs> baby, that's not going to happen, though. It's okay to have social anxiety. I know that feeling now. <laughs> Especially, like, when you get a new job uh, and... Yeah.
plus it'll be fine. They are so pure freshing, right? <laughs> Get your socially gonna ask roll the loner. The in the way you don't even need a job, so why are we Okay, please get out before you get a call. She's trying to get <laughs> So, did you catch a cold? okay to be nervous. We've all been there. Hell, that was me when I started fucking UPS and I was like, oh my god, I feel like I'm gonna fuck up. And I did. A couple of times. Oh, Boji. But somebody wasn't paying attention. Ah! <laughs> Bochi? Oh, I know that feeling. Yep. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. <laughs> I mean, hey, at least she's getting it, though. Oh. 
she go, oh, I think she figured it out. <laughs> yeah. I feel like her and Kirby from Late Back Camp would be the best of friends, but Kirby would literally bring Bochi out of her shell. <laughs> that or the girls from um, Asteroid in Love. <laughs> you guys did the Bochi! Bochi ginger ale. <laughs> no, Bochi, you're learning, baby. Huh? Mm hmm. It takes time. You'll do better. Oh, baby. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it just takes time. You did it though. Mm hmm. Hmm. 
Oh my god. <laughs> I know. You feel like you're on top of the world. <laughs> yeah, good job. There you go, baby. home from work <laughs> yeah oh you're getting sick uh, mm -hmm. me too Somebody got sick. I just need to know who her say you is and what you did. Okay. Baby accomplished a lot today. I'm so proud of her. Oh my god. Like seriously. I I mean, okay. As someone who has worked at the Dollar Tree and currently still at UPS, yes, working on customer service, in my opinion, is is not the greatest job. It, it really isn't. It's a good job, don't get me wrong. But dealing with people's problems and such on a daily basis no matter what job you're kind of doing you're still doing customer service hell like i said my mom works at a freaking hospital as a cna that's still customer service she's ha she's handling patients and all the other things that she has to do in the day within 12 hours of her shift but you know hey when we the best thing is when we get off work and we're like yeah we can go home and relax but then you gotta come home sleep and do it all again the next day. And so today is my last day off of my vacation. And I officially go back tomorrow. Which sucks because I don't want to go back tomorrow. I want to stay home and get some other things done. But I have to do it when I come home from work. And I don't get home until 6. It sucks. It really truly does. But that's my life. And you got to multi-balance. Even though sometimes I feel like I can't. It's just about getting it done but she did good today i'm proud of her like oh she's so good like she looked her in the eye she gave her a drink like oh my god that was so fucking cute even though she was trying to smile and her smile looked a little awkward-esque <laughs> and then like okay Lady Nariel <laughs> is definitely a freaking loner like in getting the like and <laughs> the confirmation that she is I, I love it I mean because sometimes yes depending on how you are around people and you're just like I am the type who just wants to be by myself all the time that is okay um <laughs> Nichika, <laughs> I, I freaking love her she gives me like hella meal vibes and also um what's her face from laid back camp as well the one with the glasses because i mean typically when you look at characters that are similar to each other they're always like upbeat and happy and she seems like the upbeat happy type character she's gonna be the one that is literally going to always push bochi out of her comfort zone very similar to he told bochi and um her best friend who was always getting her out of her comfort zone and then you know um anu best girl anu from that show always like being <laughs> the voice of reason and singing her freaking song please go watch each other bushy if you haven't seen that because uh, that show is mwah, chef's kiss freaking love that show so damn much but i mean yeah it was a good episode her sister is also nice too um but the fact is that I think her sister has figured out that Bochi is who she is, Miss Little YouTuber esque. Like, mm. but something just tells me she's not going to confront Bochi until maybe at least like the halfway point of the show. 
That's my take. If it's not the halfway point, it's gotta at least before the show's over because that is a big spoiler and I think everybody's going to find out and I think everyone will be fine with it no matter what. But we see in our right head again today. Hopefully she joins by Saturday. That's the goal because, I mean, we need the full freaking band so that we can finally have a vocalist sing every single week. And I'm ready to hear, like, original-esque songs. Like, please. Like, yes, I love me some cover songs. Hello is somebody who, once again, bandere, but, you know, as for my favorite band, Rosalia, love any cover song that they've done, like, psh, Simpho Gears songs, and then, you know, freaking Steins Gate songs. Any freaking song that Rosalia does, once again, chef kiss. But the original songs by Rosalia, that's, that is God's gift. <laughs> it really is, because they're so good, and they're just what I need at the moment and such like yeah so you, you know if you ever want a band go find Rosalia Rosalia is just Rosalia Racicillin Popping Party and Morphonica and then maybe also Afterglow yeah don't listen to Paso Palettes unless you really if you really want like the idly type things you can still listen to them but if you want like certain like oh good ass Go listen to the other bands that I talked about. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction review towards episode two of Bochi the Rock. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially on Saturday for episode three. Bye, guys.